With nervous determination, the party set foot into a domain of darkness. Many surprises awaited them. Well, most of them. Welcome to the Glass Palace and it's the last chapter of this beautiful adventure in the world of Operencia. So we must find the dragon and get the sun back. How dare he, he stole the sun. So friends, if you love Operencia, leave a like and subscribe to my channel. And it's time to go into this door. Yes, there is nothing Through more. Through those windows, more. the light of the Sun King. I'll be Where damned. Is he? It shines as bright as day. How else would it shine, Yoshka? You're ruining the moment. Where do you see? Ah, this is the shine from the Sun King. I know this statue is several unique dragons in a circle, hmm. but I like to imagine it's one circular dragon of many heads relieving himself after a large meal. Could still be several unique dragons relieving themselves after a large meal. Well, that's just disgusting. Oh, you're talking too much, guys. Stop it. Okay. And I see a nasty lizard walking on the stairways. Okay, let's get him. Well, hello, Mr. Lizard. Are you alright? I thank you for your concern, Chila. But I assure you, I'm quite all right. Okay, this dragon is defeated, but let's search this first floor. Free the Sun King, find the way to the second floor. I really don't see a problem, but okay. Have we powered this up yet? Seems like that would be important. Ooh. A channeling crystal! I never thought I'd see one with my own eyes! Hmm... Some kind of crystal? By the way... No hidden chest in this palace. At least not here. Maybe some hidden doors? No... She fell to the ground. Alia? Lying face down, she began to laugh. The old woman turned her head to the astonished faces of her companions. In mere moments, decades were removed from her face. And when she spoke, she sounded like me. It actually happened. Ooh. I am me again. I am home. I... Who I don't she? understand. She was pretending Elia, all the time. You were of the underworld. I told you, I was there when Thade attacked. I was part of his army. I don't oh believe it. God. And I fled. I wanted to live in harmony with humanity, not to enslave it as Thade aspired to. So you chose to stay in Operencia? When the battle concluded, I found no way to return to the gate before Ottila closed it. I was stranded. I used the last of my waning power to assume the form of a human woman. And for the first time in millennia, I aged. All I had to my name was this magic sack. Handed to me for use in the invasion, ironically enough. I assure you, it's yielded more weapons to fight the underworld forces than it ever did to support them. Was that your intention then? Or did you just see us as your best chance of getting back home? Can it not be both? You must understand why I could not tell you this earlier. I have no secrets from you now. I don't know that I trust you, Elia, but for once it does not horrify me to look upon your face. I wish I could say the same of you. In case there was any doubt, it's actually Elia. I want to believe you, Elia, but how do we know that you won't turn on us now that you're home? A worse threat than Thade already has the upper hand. His actions will not enslave the middle world. They will destroy it. My conscience will not allow that to happen. After much consternation and debate, they agreed to have me along. Reluctantly. 
But that was a very interesting surprise, friends. Elia was a succubus. Who was with Attila and Rekka when they find the dragon? Oh, that's a very interesting turn of the story. Okay, the story with Elia is very interesting, but let's explore this. Have we powered this up yet? And Seems like that would be important. Nothing happened. Very interesting. Good job, guys. Aha. And another lizard, of course. Okay, this lizard is defeated, and what do we have here? Except this almost useless gold. To be frank, gold in this game... It has some use, but not much, not much at all. Boom. Now I have two of these crystals. And I need some place to charge them. Let's go find one. And I have to remember where this crystal was. Oh, firewood, I miss it. One was somewhere over here and one was... No, I will go back for this firewood, because it's very rare in this game. At least at my difficulty settings. Firewood, where are you? I need you. It's a palace from the glass. It's very little firewood here. But a lot of lizards, dragons and other fellows. Oh, very important door, I believe. I was there, this door is closed, so second floor, here I comes. Meet me with all my glory. Aha! Statue of a dragon. And the chest here. Ooh! <laughs> this is important. Friends, don't miss this chest, cause it have a staff of gunsel. Sword of Attila, equip it! No! Yes! And now I have a full set! That's wonderful! Remove the energy cost of all underworld skills. Very good! And you equip the sword, how dare you! Chen equipped it without my permission. Very bad, Kyla. She was a naughty No way girl. through. Do you suppose we could blow it up? That was so much fun back in the forest. Aha! Uh -huh. And this will be some kind of puzzle. Let's go here. Really nothing. So I see no other way than go here and face this egg puzzle. It's a rejuvenation chamber. Oh, come on, and it's using egg it to puzzle. speed up the incubation of dragon connects. Like the Talking one over there. too hard. That's one way to accelerate the breeding of an army. The pipes above us channel the energy, but the power is not properly aligned at the moment. Would it in any way benefit us to complete the circuits? When a dragonkin is born, it is said to erupt from its egg in an explosion of dragon fire. The word hatch is truly an understatement. If we can get it to just the right heat before this occurs, it could prove a useful explosive. Sounds dangerous. With proper timing, we could use it to destroy the gate to the second floor. We'll only know if we try, won't we? Fill the pipes, and somehow I thought that this will charge the crystals, but no, it must destroy the gate to the second floor. No, I don't need honor. 
Helmet. Don't know what this sprout is doing here, but it might just be of use. What was that? We'll need to heat this just the right amount before we can use it on the gate to the next floor. And what will be the right amount? Can you please tell me? Okay. It's time to solve this puzzle. So, puzzle, puzzle. All these pipes is leading here to this egg. And... Pipe lead. Ah, exactly to the door. Okay, maybe now it will. Nothing is working. Definitely missing something. Okay, your turn red. Expected. What is there? Is that a place for you, Crystal? And I need to charge it. Hmm, oh, I get it now, I get it. See what you can find, little friend. Oh no. Okay, now I get it. I have to open the door right before here. And there is a second switch. No! You open the first door, the second door. I'm missing one switch. How to open this door? Let's start This looks like just your kind of place. Come on, rooster, do it. Nicely done, Mr. Rooster. And you go... Where? Okay, push this button. Good job! And he opened that door. Perfect. Ah, this puzzle is really easy. The one upstairs will take a lot of time. This is very weird. Oh no. Okay. This time I will succeed. Come on, my boy. <laughs> I just love him. Look at him. He's so proud of him. He's a real rooster. And the magic happened? No? Yes? Aha! The crystal is charged. 
quest. <laughs> we have a quest filled the pipes. And now the quest heat up the eggs. Okay, let's heat them up. puzzle Aha, now this pipe is yellow but that pipe is empty okay are you working now mister something definitely happened So one is connected, the blue one. Now I have to connect uh, maybe a red. Let's do it like that. No, it's definitely wrong. For just the hole. a little too long. And now we have a hole in the ceiling. Yes. Well, it is the second floor. Can we get through the hole somehow? Yes. Uh, no. Ah, I get it, I get it. Whoa, interesting. Really nicely done. Come on, my wild plow. And there you have it. it. Up we go. Of course, up we go. The old tale of the beanstalk has never felt more apt. The hero did end up in the dragon's castle after all. In my Look travels, I have heard the same tale spoken. Only the castle belongs to a giant, not a dragon. How strange. The giant doesn't even have a human wife. And it has a goose that lays golden eggs instead of a black head. Yeah, yeah, so I madness. know this, that story. But don't get me started on how they butchered the tail of the little pig and the wolves. Three pigs? One is plenty. I see an enemy, but I... I... Whoa. Oh, no. The campfire is protected. What a beautiful place is this glass palace. And it's a second floor, by the way. No, there will be a treasure here. But let's explore this location and we will start with killing... No. Let's see where this door leads first. Door with a dragon. Oh, it's a first level. Now I get it. Okay, Mr. Evil Monster, now it's your turn to face my mighty heroes. I 
will check it later. Intruders! During this battle I find a traitor in my crew. There was a succubus in the team and guess what? She seduced Mize and he started fighting against me. Oh this Mize, so easy to seduce. A weak spot in my army, in my party. <laughs> okay. A light spring? Here? Let's find Light this springs? Secret. Uh, sprang? From fallen shards of a hmm. broken mask worn by the Sun King this way? ages no, ago. No, not this How way. did one land in the underworld? Simple. It was stolen by Thade long ago. He saw it as his first step to dominating the middle world. So, it's well, a souvenir? I... One might call it that, ah, yes. I'm going in the right direction, it's very close. Very, very close. <laughs> okay, skeleton, what do you have? See gloves? He must have found one of the many smaller gates throughout the land. Oh Most my likely, God, so many Succubus stairs. lured him here, had to have fun with no. him, and left him in... Never stay between man and his treasure. Oh, maybe this is my very hidden and mysterious treasure. And yes, but there are more. <laughs> Where it is? It's very near, by the way. Oh, and we have a chest. Close, very close. Where are you? Secret recipe. Ah, I'm losing the light. The light. It's almost gone, and I'm so near to another secret, and I just can't see it. Oh my god, where are you, where? <laughs> but I will find the usual treasure. No, light, no, just no, where is it? Okay, let's this looks like it's been buried since the reign of Thade, or even before. Get the book and and light is gone. By the way, is there a no? That's all treasure we can find. So we got three secrets out of five. And there is something, something very close. Can I go back? What is that? No, I don't like the sound of it. It's some kind of trap. No trap. Wait a little. Oh, whole labyrinth of. <laughs> and another door, by the way. Where is this vial of light? Come on, come. No. It's so close, so close to me. It's right here. But where it is? Maybe downstairs? Oh! Fatality! Nope! Okay, one more time! But first, let's see where this door leads! This door is blocked. What else do we have here? Maybe a treasure? Aha, another door and it also closed. A very beautiful window. Okay. Well, well, well. It seems that all the doors are closed and we have to go... No, let's take this light first, but there will be something, definitely, I feel it. 
Aha, I need to glow. And now, what is this puzzle? I have to move for all. Oh. An illusionary floor? That's just evil. The question so, is, what can we do I need to see this such light to... Stop talking, guys. I need this light to avoid the traps on the floor. Now I get it. And I got achievement that I dig up all the treasures. So sadly there will be no more treasure. Okay. Aha. Very carefully. We march our way. So, up or down? Let's go down first. And... And... There is nothing here? Really? Oh, that's another puzzle. I can lift this column and make my way... But where? <laughs> I don't know. And I find a last campfire in this game. Ah, three of three. And I got achievements that it was the last one. Ah, now I get it. To get to the treasure, I must do something like that. Hmm. Come on, Colum, move. it from this side so <laughs> I will be trapped but I have an idea Stay this way and you go with me now let's try it like that and I got a lava ball and I don't know where to use it but it's all fine. Now I have to create a road right there. No. One more. Okay, puzzle. Are you solved? Can we reach this? It was just a pile of gold. <laughs> this all was about a pile of gold. Yes, I see nothing more. Okay. And it's time to go now. <laughs> oh, I knew it. for me to go up because I done everything I can here and only one secret left 
Bro, look at that. Brr, it's too high for me. I'm really afraid of it. Have they no need to lock up their gold in this castle? Not that I'm complaining. Okay, he is defeated and what do we have here? And we don't have a crystal. Purple crystal. Okay, I bet I have to go down and find this crystal. Hmm. And this is the top floor. Oh, and that was the way down. But that's good, it's time to find this crystal. It took me about an hour to find out where to get this crystal, so we must return to the room where yellow crystal located, right here, and use the rooster once again. See what you can find, little friend. Come on. My lovely proud of himself rooster. Do you? And aha, crystal is deactivated. And now we can take it because we need it on the upper level. So let's go back to the very top of this location. And I'm back to the very top of this glass castle. But where should Have we powered this up yet? Uh oh. It seems like no, that would be no. important. Where I should place this crystal? I really forgot this. Maybe. No. Not that way, definitely. Hmm, maybe this way. Locked, and we don't have the right key. And we don't have the right key. Okay. And frankly, I believe not this way through. <laughs> there are some kind of puzzle over here. Okay. I lost in this amazing... We powered this up yet? Seems like that would be important. Oh, that will be the way. Yes, nice. Crystal. Yes, crystal is charged. I'm ready to go. I'm ready to solve this puzzle. It's... Oh, what happened? Very weird. Okay. But first, where was it? Not here. But here. Oh, I get it. I get it now. Come with me. But first, by the way, why I don't have that key? Chest keys found zero. Oh my god, too bad. I need them all. And here we are. We have a dragon puzzle. How to solve it? Let's find out. Actually, this dragon painted on the wall, so we must just gather it. Start with the head. Good 
old puzzle. Is it correct? One horn, evil one, and not so evil one. No, this is not a correct. That will be correct one. Let's check it. Yes, a very proud one, a big one and a smaller one. Now wings and legs. Okay, this part. Half of the wing come with me. Is that a body? Is that a correct body? I don't know. <laughs> and maybe not, maybe not. Maybe, maybe this one or even that one. No, definitely not. That's look good. And now it's his back. Perfect. And the neck. Neck connected. Neck is. Fade, of course. Such an ego attached to the former lord of this castle. But what if it's not Fade? What if it's the dragon who confronted us on the world tree? Couldn't be. This one's not blind enough. <laughs> if only I had such power in the underworld. Wait a second, you don't? You can't blind him again? We have the sword and the armor. We'll be fine. Yeah, fine. Hmm. Okay, what should be in this upper corner? It seems there must be the end of wing and we have two, this one and that one. Which one will it be? Does it fit? I think yes. Of course, maybe not, but... Who cares? Now you, end of the game, come with me, please. I just get... I just... Is it right? No... I think this is not exactly correct. I must switch the places. Now it looks more garlic. Definitely. Aha, a 
half of the dragon is complete. No. That is his leg. Wait a minute. No, almost. Way piece of tail. So, oh my god, this battle is fun. Aha! Uh -huh. Perfect. Now, we are almost done. And, aha! Uh -huh. Puzzle is completed. <laughs> Ooh, my friends, oh my god. It was super hard puzzle, and of course the head of the statue. I think I know where this heavy stone head. Oh, Stefan, you tell me that I will find it, but you tell nothing about this very hard puzzle. <laughs> oh my God, I'm very happy I finally find it. Now it's a good time to make a save. And there is only one place right here left unexplored on this map. So let's go. Yes, there will be an enemy. Sukub intruders. Well, well, well <laughs> again. Axe of Peru. Oh, I love Peru. He's a very nice god. And do he have a powerful axe? Ah, not that powerful, really. Okay, we will skip it. Do we have anything else here? Gold coins. Aha, a chest key. And that's all. I strongly believe I explore everything I can on this level. Everything open, all secrets found, map is not explored, but who cares. Time to rest and I believe face the last enemy, the dragon himself. Well, Mr. Dragon, it's time to us for us to meet. And how to do it? Yes, maybe that's it. <laughs> what is there? Elevator here? For what reason I want to fight this dragon? Oh my god. Okay, it's <laughs> time number two. Okay, Mr. Dragon, it's time for us to meet and face in the final battle evil with good. And how to do it, I don't know. Nobody knows. And it's very weird. Hmm. Well, 
maybe I should take that one. And then go. To do that. This last lift puzzle is just insane. Okay, that's how to solve it. Let's go down. Turn the boots on, go up. It's completely insane. Not made for humans, and now one. And that's it. Puzzle solved, map takes Lord. <laughs> it's time to make a save, definitely. So friends, it's a time to meet a final boss. Let's face him. Dragon, where are you? Where are you, greatest evil of this land? I want to see you and there. fight. Do you see him? No. Kind of hard to miss a man glowing like the sun, Kampo. The Sun King. Ah, it's we a found sun him. King. It's time for you to bring light to us all. We'll help. Don't worry, Sun King, we will save you. And you, the big bad dragon? Congratulations! A familiar face greeted my companions. One I had yet to see myself on our great journey. He didn't notice me. I aimed to keep it that way, so I hid. I see you have made it this it's far. Not really familiar. I am impressed. That's what they all say. And then, they're not impressed anymore, because we've killed them. Good one, old man. Thank you. You never trusted me, did you? I must admit, my honest nature makes me a terrible liar. Didn't even fake my name. Well, I offer nothing but truth now. I take it you served the dragon we fought at the World Tree, and he made you a deal to live here. I serve myself, and this has been my home. My realm, since my brother died 50 years ago. Simply bend the knee, and there is a place in my royal guard for each of you. Elite status. You've certainly proven your worth. No, You can no, see how no. quickly we're all jumping to the opportunity. I ask only obedience. All humanity is welcome to this realm. To thrive, under me, or there will be... Consequences. Free the Sun King, Sharkoz. That is the only way humanity will thrive once more. I see. Consequences it is then. And I'll have you know I abhor violence. You have a funny way of showing it. There were only four of you by the river. I could have killed you there before you ever saw me. Instead, you told us you were going to Deva Fortress. Who do you think unleashed its curse? Yes, it is a peasant. My hope was that you would end I up there. It. And that its evil would scare you from your fool's errand. Or kill us. I never wished you dead. Until now. Until now. It's pretty powerful, but nothing special. Okay, let's try. He continues to resist our attacks. This is beyond magic. It's as though he isn't human. My mother was human. My father was human. I, however, am not. It cannot be. Unless your mother gave birth in the underworld. But that would make you... Say it. Come on. You know you want to say it. A dragon. dragon Maybe humans aren't course. so stupid after all. Dragons have scales and multiple heads. That makes you way too ugly to be one. I take that back, but if that is the form you prefer... So, he's so changing the forms, and now he's a dragon and health point restored. Both oh of your God. parents were human, why do you Whoa. despise us so? He's so I do dead. not despise humanity. It is merely inferior to dragon kind. You must make your parents so proud. My father never knew I existed. And my mother raised me with nothing but contempt. Because you were born a dragon. 
because I wasn't born dragon enough. And my main character is dead. And somehow I can't use my abilities. Oh my god. Oh, my mage can! He looks like a dragon from lightning, so let's try to fire. I no. wasn't completely dishonest with you before. And don't even try, Chilla. No blast of light will blind me down here. His new form combines armor and magical illusion. Incredible! Let's just hope the Sword of Attila can still work its own magic. I had hidden in the shadows for too long. It won't. At least not until my powers of the underworld have weakened him first. Now, go my friends. Release the Sun King while I hold him off. Well, it cannot be. It is. I thought you were dead. She told me you were dead. Yaga told you lots of things. You should have known better. The Sun King, confined within those rings. Not for much longer. Everyone, attack the rings when you can. Because really, who needs to use their weapons on endless droves of attacking underworlders? So I need to destroy this cage or these portals? I don't really know, but let's... <laughs> Just let everyone go, and never enter the middle world again. That will not happen. Then, Or it fight. will happen. These pairs of monsters will never stop. I will free the sun, because it's my destiny, if you don't know it. Keep rotating, so I'm very close to free the Sun King and get rid of that dragon. I'm really tired of. That's the last of them. Oh yeah. To the yes. Sun King. Touching his bonds may harm you. I'll handle this. Napkirai, you are free. Thank you. Napkirai. He is too weak. Had he been down here much longer, he would have died. I guess Sharkoz wasn't accounting for that little detail. My companions attempted their escape, but I could hold off the dragon's power no longer. I have done all I can, friends. We should be plenty for what you need to do. One day you will understand, Elia. But your companions, they are all about oh, to no, die. we will not die. Alia's magic has weakened him considerably. Allow us we to finish the job. 200 health point. 
<laughs> oh my god, that will be easy. And... You were in league with the God of Bontiash. I was. Until they failed me. Until they were unable to stop you. You were responsible for their deaths? One escaped my wrath. The special one. Boldishad. That's right. You knew him. Kella, do you recall the Mason's enhancements to King Brent's fortress? I made a deal with Boldishar to sabotage the castle and turn its grand army to frogs. I didn't need that possible opposition right now. Dragon, stop talking. I don't In see return, a health for I enhanced his budding power. It was your beloved Anna herself who cried the tear that set off the spell to sink the castle. Without my interference, you likely would never have met. The way I see it, Kella, you should be thanking me. But you also set her spirit free in Deva. Was it any worse than what you did? My redemption is nigh. It begins with your death. Oh! He stopped talking and he had only 20 health point left. So, friends, it will be the final strike. Oh no, he back to human form. And still fighting? <laughs> really, friend, just surrender. Uh, that... That was bad. Let's use our superpowers to bring our heroes back. No, really, you will not survive, friend. You absolutely have no chance at all. No sense to store all this power, so I will just use it all. And even that one, which he has resisted. Today is the day when you will die. Oh, fire works good. And that's almost it. He's gone. Sun King gets free. It appears once more I have underestimated you. Yes, yes. Do yeah. it. End this. I much prefer death to the eternal hell of failure. No! Don't. Why would you say, Mabelia? You know what he's done. I do not wish to see Sharkos destroyed, that is true. But I only stop this execution for the wishes of another. Ottila himself. My brother's murderer? That makes no sense. For once, I'm seeing eye to eye with our adversary. Nothing more will I say of this now. You will know all once you fulfill your promise to Attila. Return his sword to him. Will we ever see you again, Elia? It is unlikely, but one never knows. What a beautiful game, and this will be the end. The glass palace had stood as the embodiment of Sharkus's will. His will now shattered. The castle followed suit. We escaped just in time. And I bid my companions, my friends, farewell. As if by magic, debris from the castle sealed the gate just behind them. And the sun shone once more across Operantia.
It did not take long for the young hero to keep his promise. You have returned. I suspected you would. Did Elia do as I asked? She requested we spare the dragon's life, if that's what you refer to, Your Majesty. And we did. Did she not tell you why? Only that it was by your order, nothing more. As you'll recall, Elia stayed behind as you left. She apologized to me personally for her role in Thade's invasion. Our conversation took a turn, and we came to a startling, undeniable revelation. Let me guess, she was one of your many legendary short-lived loves? Your assumption annoys me, Bandit, but it approaches the truth more than I'd normally wish to admit. Oh, this will be good. When I was very young, I met a beautiful young witch. A human born in Operencia, who claimed to be visiting from her new home in the Underworld. Her name was Yaga, and she possessed an inner strength that fascinated me. I found myself no match for her charms. After one night of passion, she showed me her gate to the Underworld. One of many in Operencia, it turns out, each hidden right under our noses. Yaga returned home, and I never saw her again. Yet a piece of me stayed with her, it seems. You don't mean... It is said that when a human gives birth in the Underworld, a dragon may result. Oh no... I now know this to be true. It would seem my son shares his father's drive for conquest. And I thank you for sparing his life. I don't know what to say. You're welcome? I still question the decision. Sharkos still remains a threat. Only time will tell. But alas, my own family matters are not why I requested your return. You hold what you call the Sword of Attila. The name flatters me. But by Hadar, I was hardly the first great man to wield it. And now, a great man wields it once more. But I do need to leave this here, don't I? So that you may rest in peace. Remember, the sword has a mind of its own. It likes you. And I know better than to face its wrath. Rest assured, so long as a hero such as you possesses the blade, in peace, I most certainly will rest. Take it. Make it your own. Rule with it. I'm sorry, Your Majesty. I think I misunderstood you. By right, Charkos deserves your kingdom. Well, not a simple peasant like me. Kingdoms are indeed passed down among bloodlines. But they are earned by valor such as yours. Bloodlines are no match for bloodshed. I'd say such valor has been proven many times over. Yes, you have earned your kingdom. With my blade in your possession, few will question your right to the throne. In fact, you have already claimed your castle. It is just... More highly elevated now than when you left it. So friends, Aparencia come to an end. I was very glad to Before see going all. their separate ways, the companions the gathered video. one last time. They were never happier. Lovers reunited. Former adversaries were now the best of friends. Young knights and magicians looked at the stars, unaware of their own futures of legend. And the farmer's son, the most unlikely hero of them all, ruled. It is said that all of their days were lived happily ever after. But really, 
What fun is that? Ha <laughs> ha